isang kasadyahanan sa kabanwahanan na maghahatag na kita or mag-receive na kamo sa inyo Certificate of Merit. This will be given by, of course, the Executive Director of Iloilo Festival Foundation Incorporated, Ms. Joyce Clavesilias. But before anything else, partner, just would like to acknowledge the arrival of our city councilor, Honorable Doc Nick Baronda, and Honorable Ellie Estante. Good evening, sirs. So, nagadamo na ang mga tao na risubong sa Freedom Grandstand because everyone is excited to know who are the winners sa nagkalain-lain na tayo competitions, illumination, kasadyahan, sad-sad, uh, tribe competition, ano pa gin? Madamo pa? Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras. Kadamo actually sa side events natin. Joining uh, Ma'am Joyce Cavicillas is, of course, Sir Fons. Fons Baldonado and... Um... Sir Bombet, Gilbert Bombet Marine. All right, let's start to call our tribes for kasajahanan sa kabanwahanan. First tribe is the Kaing Festival. May we request the Mayor of Municipality of Leon, Honorable Maria Lina Cabana Holipas. And also joining our Mayor Holipas is the Tourism Officer of the Municipality, um, Madam Maria Annalisa Camago. Tribe Manager, Reverend Father Emmanuel Tubade or Tube Rada. Ang ilang choreographer, Mr. Stephen G. Hakosalem. And Musical Director, G.P. Henson. Palapakan natin for the Municipality of Leon. They are representing Kaing Festival. While nag-receive ya ang Kaing Festival Artistic Team, ginapanawagan na mo ng iba ng festivals na please ready na kamo para dire-diretsyo na ang paghatag natin sa inyo Certificate of Merit. And next, next is the Artistic Team of Kasag Festival of Banate. From the mayor of the municipality of Banati is Honorable Peter Paul Gonzalez. Tribe manager and tourism officer, Mr. Artemis A. Binyas. Tribe manager, Laura Bakong and Mark Anthony Diamante. And their choreographers, Mali Ramos Jr. and Glenn G's Baba. Musical director, G.P. Henson. Again, from the municipality of Banati, Kasak Festival! Okay, ang third nato ng pagalawagon of the artistic team sa Sad Festival of the Municipality of Leganes, headed of course by their Mayor Honorable Vicente Junjun P. Hain the Second, with their Tourism Officer Jerry M. Anas, Tribe Manager Dr. Soila Pinongko Jr., Choreographer Charlene Pudedera. Artistic Directors William Recabar and Mark Jones Espartero. Musical. And the musical director is Blasito Ledesma. Once again from the municipality of Leganes, Sad Festival! There you go! Ka-perfect, bala sa aton posisyon, makita natin. Ang aton, ha-ha! Ayan, anami isang view natin. Do my prompt perfect. At least hindi, hindi ka nang lang mag-liad, Anna. O, ara na, one, two, three. Ay, hindi na. Later na. Ang pika ko. Medyo oily na tayo. And next, ladies and gentlemen, from the Municipality of Oton, Katagman Festival. Again, from Saad Festival, Municipality of Leganes, Honorable Vicente Junjun P. Hain II. And of course, joining Mayor High in the second are the Tourism Officer, uh, Jerry M. Anas, Tribe Manager, Dr. Soila Pinongos Jr., Choreographer, Colin Pudadera, Artistic Directors, William Recabar and Mark Jones Espartero, and the Musical Director, Blasito Ledesma.
So in a sad festival, no? uh, recently concluded lang ni siya, I think, last week or two weeks ago. I was also there for their uh, Miss Sad Festival. So pag-ogin ni, natapos sila ng festival. And now receiving their certificates of merit. The artistic team of SAD Festival, some municipality of Leganes, headed of course by the Mayor Honorable Vicente Junjun P. Hain II. And supporting Mayor Hain II are the members of the artistic team. Ang mga wala ginakapoy ng mga members sa artistic teams. Thank you, Sad Festival. Ang ato next festival is again Katagman Festival from the municipality of Oton. Of course, together with their mayor, Honorable Sofronio Fusen Jr., ang ila tourism officer Cheche De Moos, tribe manager Dr. Darwin A. Haro, choreographer Romel B. Flohen, associate. Choreographer John Paul Patrimonio and musical director Rose Ryan Velez. So just an erratum for the sad festival. Other choreographer is Mr. Mark S. Martinez. Thank and you very thank much. You. And now we move forward to Tultugan Festival. The mayor of the Municipality of Maasim and at the same time, the Tribe Manager, Honorable Francis Amboy! With the History of Officer, Justine Casho, Choreographer, Indian John Fanimoto, and Musical Director, Freddy Lopez. Once again, Tutugan Festival of Maasim! Next, we have Banag Festival, Municipality of Anilao, represented by their Municipal Mayor and Tribe Manager, Honorable Nathalie Ann F. Debuque, Tourism Officer, Municipality of Anilao, Emerson A. Franco, Choreographer, Ray Vincent Haina, and Musical Director, Vincent Villaflor. Once again, Banag Festival. Now, welcome natin, of course, Vice Mayor Matet de Buque. Honorable Matet de Buque is the tribe manager of the Banaag yes. Festival. And our next festival natin, halin sa municipality of Nulucena, the Cry of Heligoon Festival. And of course, ginapangunahan sa ila Mayor, Honorable Lisel Montejar Seville, Tourism Officer, Robert D. Gualta, also kaupo si Ms. Cheryl M. Luis, Tribe Manager Roy Sol de Villa, Choreographer Freddie Lloyd Serra, and Musical Director Zedric Tumula. The artistic team of the Cry of Helicon Festival of Nulo Sena.
next festival to receive their certificate is Hirinungao Sogida Dunay from the municipality of Kalinog. Represented, of course, by their mayor, Honorable Francisco Al Calvo. With their tribe manager and tourism officer, Dr. Chester C. Larodel. Their production manager, Honorable May John Paul C. Hurtada. Their artistic directors, Reno Mar Sokenio and Dr. Mark Anthony Hurtada. Their choreographers, Jerlene Francisco, Julius Cesar Cervolles. Ernie Salmeron and Errol J. Villalobos, their musical director, Nico Alvarez, and J. Alfie Albano. Kalinog. My Chavez is from yeah. Kalinog. Yes! Hi guys! Mga kasimanwa ko, hello! Next week, mapuli ko to. O, oh, diba? Ang linay isang Kalinog. Ay, hindi na nag-alaw. Ay, hindi man, hindi man. But thankful ako nga I was able to uh, call them. And now, from Zaraga Pantat Festival! Represented by their mayor and tribe manager, Arnold Maria, Jophil Maranion, Soldevilla. Tourism officer, Joanna Marie Pinuela. Assistant tribe manager is Arnold Remia Sularan. Choreographers, Kian Martinizar, Janeline Venegas, Cedric Aliman, Marsh P, John Perlado, and the musical directors are Ivan Ligada and Alter J. Umadai. Once again, Pantak. Festival! And uh, those were tries for Casa Jaha sa Kapanwahanan. Up next, our elimination, starting off with Tribo Sidlangan. We have the tribe manager. This will be awarded by uh, Sir Judgey Pena, the IFFI chairperson. And of course, the president of IFFI, Alan Ryan Tan. Again, let's start off with Tribo Sidlangan with the tribe manager and choreographer, Linan C. Soncho. Assistant tribe manager, Michael D. Soncho. Choreographer and assistant director, Peter D. Diocos. Musical director, Guinevere Bisonia. Assistant musical directors, Mark Angelo Torres and Alfredo Salapantan. Dance Masters, Helen L. Bogador and Joem Hunsan. Costume Designers, Christopher John Puerta and Hector Totong Helian Garin. And the Lights Designer, Jerome Navales. Again, Tribo Sidlangan! And also joining our gentlemen sa uh, stage of the awards and certificate of merit is our Honorable Vice Mayor Jeffrey Ganson. Our next tribe for illumination is Tribo Familia Sagasa. Artistic team led by tribe manager Francis Mike Vito. Assistant tribe manager Ismael Vito III. Choreographer Jomar Sustento. Musical director Jomar Guzman. Dance master Kurt Louis Leonida. Costume designer Roger Arsenal. Artistic director Ron Matthews Espinosa. Production manager Catherine Gwyneth Sullivan Aman. And production consultant Stephen Hakosalem. Once again, the artistic team of Tribo Familia Sagasa. 
Ari ba lang, familia sa gasa? Mang, pwede ba ka mo mang sa gasa? Basta ka sa stage, subong. Kung ari na ka mo. And the next to receive their certificate is Tribo Mandurial with their tribe manager, Carl John Goreseta Alaban, assistant tribe manager, Teofilo Zamora, choreographer, John Ray Pajo Colliado, musical director, Christopher Apalayan, dance master, Henry Segovia, costume designer, Jonathan Napilan, production manager, Michael Angelo Salcedo, Tribo Mandurial! Next is Tribo Ilongo Hanon. Tribe Manager, Musical Director, Production Manager, and Artistic Director, Cedric Tumulak. Assistant Tribe Manager and Artistic Director, Ronnie Butch Hamantov. Choreographer, Ria Espanola. Dance Master, Wayne Peconcilio and Costume Designer, Jamie Abilarde. Once again, Tribo Ilongo Hanon. Next, we have Tribo Puntatala with their tribe manager, Ruby A. Dumalaog. Assistant tribe manager, Sharon S. Salado. Choreographer, John Paul Patrimonio. Musical director, Rod Ryan Velez. Dance master, Rainier John Agustin. Costume designer, Hector Totong Heliangarin. Artistic director, Romel Flowen. Production manager, Martin Escander. Member of production, Florencio Abelia Jr. Once again, Tribo Buntagtala! Okay, next, Tribo Kahiro of Pavia. Kaupo ng ilang tribe manager, Charlie T. Guyos and Gerard Peter Goriseta uh, Sal Zaldariaga. Ang ilang choreographers, Ariel Defensor Sogeko, Don Brian Monsale. Musical director, John Edward Banzale. Dance master, Rem Casiano Patnubay II. Costume head artist, Michael Apiladas. Props head artist, Philip Apiladas. Artistic director, Edgardo Amar. Stage manager, Russell Gonzaga. And marketing and social media, Mr. Christian Paul Joaquin. Tribo Kahiro of Pavia. with their tribe manager and choreographer, Ross John Pencochillo, their choreographer, Gilbert Marsanas, and John Louis Hepulia, musical director, Ryan Luna, assistant musical director, Francis Tristan Fariolan, dance masters, Mark Louis Urolfan, Kenneth Prietos, Niesro Jaco Studio Designer Gerald Heniblazo Lights Designer Genesis Jean Cobita Artistic Consultants Jerlyn Francisco Errol J. Billy Lobos and Reno Mar Sukenio Tribo Iafa Joining us tonight, ladies and gentlemen, Congresswoman Jam Jam Bolota!
Compress woman uh, Jam Jam Baronda will be joining, of course, our esteemed uh, panel here to give the awards for our uh, uh, recipients of the merits or certificates. Now let's move forward to Sud Sud Sakalirial, Dribo Parianon. Tri Manager and Artistic Director Oscar V1, Choreographer Alfred Joseph Muya, and Musical Director is Perzeval Yukare. Once again, Tribo Parianon. Tribe Manager Melvin Villanueva, Assistant Tribe Manager and Musical Director Genesis Subagaisai, Choreographer Henry Segovia, Dance Master Fidel Drake Fantilagan, Costume Designer Michael Salcedo, and Artistic Director Melvin Villanueva. Tribo Panad! Molave, Tribe Manager Jamer Canlas, Choreographer Mark Bernaldez, Musical Director Ryan Di Maulo, Dance Master Salem John Suelo, and Costume Designer Ginny Abelarde. Tribo Molave. to receive their certificate is Tribo Paghili Ugyon with their tribe manager, Jobert Intripido, as is the tribe manager, Mary Chris Fernandez, choreographer, Vindil Palmas, musical director, John Michael De La Cruz, dance master, or assistant musical director, uh, Jer Jeremia Mino, with their dance masters, El John Britannico, Angelo Cordero Jr., their costume designer, Warren Bellina, and artistic director, Jessoni Peneda. Tribo Paghili Ugyon. Next is Tribo Aninipay. Troy manager, Rainer Carado. Assistant Tribe Manager, Rani and Carado. Choreographer and Artistic Director, Lonely Carado. Musical Director, Ran Carado. Dance Master, Luigi Bass. And Costume Designer, Michael Duhon. Once again, Tribo Aninipay. Next, we have our Dinagyao Tribe competition, starting off with Tribo Manduriao. Our Tribe Manager, Heidi Aspilia. Assistant Tribe Manager, Mervin Hope G. Villanueva. Assistant Tribe Manager, Flor Chris Joen Garcia. Choreographer, Robert Lapating. Musical Director, Ulysses Balalitan Jr. Dance Masters, John Espinitra and Glenn Babak. Costume Designer and Artistic Director, Genesis C. Rile. Production Managers, Mervin Hope G. Villanueva and Flor Chris I. Garcia. Once again, Tribo Mandoriao! Tribo Manduria will be represented by Mr. Rajan C. Pedro, Assistant Musical Director.
Next tribe nato ng tribo taga Barrio. Ang ila tribe manager Raymond G. Hangit. Assistant Tribe Managers, Jaisel Bay Farillon and Rhoda Cartagena. Artistic Director and Choreographer, Romel B. Ploen. Associate Choreographer, John Paul Patrimonio. Musical Director, Road Ryan A. Veles. Dance Master, Michael G. Oro. Costume Designer, Hector Totong Heliangarin. Props and Set Designer, Florencio C. Abelio Jr. And Production Manager, Rainier John A. Agustin. Tribo Tagabario. Next to receive their certificate is Tribo Sigabo with their tribe manager, Salvador M. Besares. Assistant tribe manager, Matilde S. Llamosa. Choreographer, Brian A. Francisco. Musical directors, Juanito Sungano Jr. and Joffrey Clyde Valderrama. Dance master, John Mark Hamandre. Costume designer, Neil Brian Martirizar. Artistic Director, Christopher Rice Grabato. Production Manager, Cheryl Tayoni. Members of Production, Saulo Letsoncito and Gilbert Asiniero. Once again, Tribo Sigabo. Next is Tribo Salugnon! Tribe Manager, Dr. Cynthia Ponsalan. Assistant Tribe Manager, Production Manager, John Abaygar. Choreographer, George Susibilia Jr. Musical Director is Blas Villarus. Dance Master is Laura Mayer Vergara. And Costume Designer and Artistic Director is Christopher John Puerta. Once again, Tribo Salugnon! Next, we have Tribo Panay. Tribe Manager, Melanie J. Tabaculde. Assistant Tribe Manager, Ian A. Taxagon. Choreographer, Lonel Robles Carado. Musical Director, G.P. Henson. Dance Masters, Luigi Bass and uh, Mali Ramos. Costume Designer and Production Manager, Jomel G. Mirabuena. Costume Designer, Michael Apiladas. Artistic Director, Roque Magsipo. And Member of Production, Jimmy Abilarde. Tribo Panay! Tribo Pagidayat ang sunod, Tribe Manager Ligaya H. Montelihao. Assistant Tribe Manager Noel L. Tubungbanwa. Choreographer Steven Hakosalem. Musical Director Ivan Kid Ligada. Dance Masters Mark Anthony Bilbao and Adrian Falimoto. Costume Designer Nikki Sandrix Monares. Artistic Director Jomar Sustento. Production Manager Celso Argion. Director Edgardo Amar. Production Director Ron Matthews Espinosa and Production Designer Roger John Arsenal, Tribo Paghidaet. Next is Tribo Ilonganon with their tribe manager Ali Joy Alonzaga, 
as is the tribe managers, her mama Mon and Neri Godilano, choreographers, Charlene Francisco and Errol J. Villalobos, musical director, Raymond Ferolino, costume designer, Paul Jerome Pinuela, dance masters, Leonilo Lizao, Farrell Lozada, Gilbert Barzanas, and their artistic director, Renomar Sokenio, assistant musical directors, John Edmond Bantige, Gino Santiliana. Their associate director, John Louis Hebulia, and production manager, Arthur Husa Jr. Tribo Ilonganon! Make some noise, Tribo Sila! <laughs> tribe manager, production manager from Alba Halva, assistant tribe manager, Astrid Aresco, choreographer, artistic director, Ramil Huyatid, associate choreographer, Alfred Joseph Muya, associate choreographers, Vincent Heine, and Marl Bernaldes, musical director, RJ Amalihan, dance master, Charles Ryan Empedrado, and costume designer, Brent Naranja. Once again, Tribo Sila! Okay, so once again, we are at the awarding ceremony of our Iloilo de Nagia Festival competitions this 2024. At the start of the program, we will be having our invocation to be led to us by Father Rechi Senorio OSA of San Jose Parish Placer. May I request everyone to, to kindly stand? stand? Let us continue putting ourselves in the presence of God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord Jesus, our dear Señor Santo Nino, our caring and loving God, during this Iloilo Dinagyang Festival 2024, you have given us the best and have blessed us. You have supported us and have strengthened us. You have protected us and provided us with every good thing. Lord Jesus, our dear Señor Santo Nino, we are very grateful for, for all you have given us. You have blessed us and attended to our needs. You have granted our request and favored us with so many good things. And so, we thank you, Lord Jesus, our dear Señor Santo Nino. We praise you. We glorify you. Thank you so much for your graces. Thank you so much for your blessings. We humbly pray that they may also give you the best and be a blessing to your people, our brothers and sisters. May we also serve and save them. May we also protect and provide what is beneficial to all. Amen. Mama Mary, our Lady of the Most Holy Ro Rosary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, our patron and protector, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, 
Amen. Viva, Señor Santo Niño. Viva, 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 Señor. Viva, 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 Señor Santo Niño de Cebu. Viva, viva, viva. You may all take your seat. Okay, ano kita subong liwat sa ating awarding ceremony, madam? Bukit kita sa ipanagtag ng awards for this evening in our different competitions. Can they just stay there, relax sa mga viewers natin? Kagaya na 15,000 na over Facebook, no? Wow! A shower of love. A shower of love. Sige lang. And we are actually enjoying, we are your host for the awarding ceremony this Dinagyao Festival 2024. I'm Kate Chavez. My name is Joe. Jordan Toledo. I'm Carmel Romero. And I'm Reina Clamor. Sino ayan? I'm a champion! The who? Sino ayan? Balantayan gini. Yes, sa mga galantaw sa mga online right now, kadamu-damu sang tao diri. We are so excited to announce all the results. But of course, um, to make sure lang that we get to hear from our, uh, of course, partners in IFFI. Ladies and gentlemen, let's all welcome Sir Judgey Lopez Pena, the chairman of IFFI, together with the president of IFFI, Sir Alan Wyantan, to give their message. Mga gabi sa inyo tanan. Ah, uh, dagino kay balo ko no ko pagsamat sa inyo sa mga nagaka-cooperate sa aton mga mayor naton. Ah, uh, ako aton nga mayor, pinilang aton nga mayor, Mayor Jerry Trinias. Nagpasalamat kay kami sa inyo dako sa inyo nga kooperasyon kag hindi lang sa kooperasyon sa inyo nga pagintra sa aton nga dinagyang 2024. Ah, ginatingwaan gid na akon kag sang akon ng mga upod sa AFI nga dason tuig i-level up naton ang aton nga dinagyang. Labi na gid ang uh, bag-o nga new new uh, sadsad sa kalerial nga daw na ano ta na dulat na ina progin balik na akon. Gani Kagina sa hapon, naglibot ko, nagupot ko na sa sad-sad to. Kagita na ako ko na ano ang pastada sa aton nga, nga mga tribo nga nagkadto sa kaliriya, nagkalibot dito. So may nakurikanan na ako muna inaasubong. So na sa'ng tuig, tingwaan gina namun sa IFI, na i-level up gina to niya ang sad-sad sa kaliriya. Ganit sa liwat, madamog yung salamat. Sa inyo nga pagkari, hindi rin yung gabi, kag sa inyo nga mga dako nga kooperasyon. Mayang gabi sa inyo natin. Thank you very much, of course, as a hard-working chairperson sa Iloilo Festival Foundation Incorporated. We have Sir Judgey Pena. And we would also like to acknowledge the provincial administrator, Dr. Raul Banyas. Palapakan natin. And at this point, we will be introducing our judges sa ato nagkalain-lain yung mga competitions para makilala natin sila tanan, no? Let's start off with our multi-skilled performer, dancer, and aerialist. Former soloist of Ballet Philippines and a former member of Kawilihan Dance Troupe, we have Mr. Lucky Jan Vincentino. Our next judge is the Academic and Development Consultant in Tourism and Associate Professor at the Asian Institute of Tourism, UP Diliman, Dr. Randy Alambay.
Ladies and gentlemen, our next judge is a multi-awarded choreographer and artistic director of the UP Dance Company. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for Miss Maria Elena Lano Alvarez. <laughs> Our next judge, our next judge is a teacher, stage actor, mentor, and theater director, Professor Alfredo Diaz. Our next judge is a master or artistic director of La Salle Dance Company. The LaSalle Dance Company Street in DLSU and Benilde Experimental Dance. We have Mike Svilioso. Next, we have Master Trainer, Teacher, Choreographer, Curator, and Director, Mr. Herbert Alvarez. Ladies and gentlemen, our next judge is a theater actor, theater director, and chairman of the best of festival dancers or dances and Panaad San Negros. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome director Rudy Revetze. Our next judge is a chief operating officer of Solesta Nelson Corp. Choreographer of ASEAN Sea Games and Kasadjan Festival, Mr. Julius Soliesta. Our next judge is the president and founder of Lika PH Dance Program and the former artistic director of Air Dance. We have Mr. Rosam Sickle Sam Prudenciado Jr. Our next judge is an award-winning film and television director and production designer for both television and film, director Jeffrey Jeturian. And our next judge is a theater actor, theater director, artistic director for Beyond Fortress Collective and secretary of NCCA Committee on Dramatic Arts. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Ted Nudgen Takan. Our next judge is a production designer and chief culture and arts officer of the production design and technical services division of the CCP, Mr. Ricardo Eric Cruz. Our next judge is the former vice head of the NCCA Committee on Dance, artistic director of Anak Bale Balayan Aja. We have Mr. Peter De Vera. And our next judge is a th trainer and educator and currently the department chair of the physical education of the College of Pescar West Visaya State University, Dr. Noel Mondejar. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome our next judge. She is an arts manager, cultural organizer, theater and film actress, and theater director. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome director Tanya P. Lopez. Now our next judge is a vice president for finance and administration of the Philippine Normal University and current chair of NCCA Committee on Dance, Dr. Lordinio Vergara. Our next judge is a public anthropologist, educator, 
author and film and art critic, we have Tito Genova Valiente. Our next judge is an arts manager, cultural administrator, and the department manager of the Cultural Center of the Philippines Cultural Exchange, Madam Carmencita Chingay Bernardo. Our next judge is a Philippine representative to the International Federation of Art Councils and Cultural Agencies and Philippine representative to the Asia Dance Committee in South Korea. Currently, Deputy Executive Director of the National Commission for Culture and the Arts. Ladies and gentlemen, let's all warmly welcome Madame Marichu Deliano. Now our next judge is a director, writer, actor, producer, teacher, learner, and the lighting director, Direct Dennis Marasigan. Our next judge is a chairman of the National Dance Committee of the National Theater Institute, founder and artistic director of the Quezon City Ballet, Halili Cruz School of Dance in Halili Cruz Conservatory. Chief Judge for Kasadiyahan sa Kabanwahanan, Madam Shirley Halili Cruz. Our next judge, our Chief Judge for the Illumination, is a multi-awarded theater director, arts and heritage advocate, and a festival curator. We have Director Chris Maliado. And let's meet our chief judge for our Dagyang tribes, former president and artistic director of the Cultural Center of the Philippines, former soloist and artistic director of Ballet Philippines. Put your hands together for Mr. Nestor O. Hardin. And there you have it. Now grab it on your set of judges. Very big up in get in all our competitions, may it be illumination, tribe competition, kasadyahan, we invited the best of the best of our judges para naman niya, we will determine who will win for this year. We were talking about this earlier before we started with the awarding ceremony and we told ourselves that ay kabud like it siya. It's yes. gonna be really hard and imagine we always, you know, as hosts, it's basic for us to say uh, judges will always have the hardest job but I swear with the tribe earlier like today the Dagyang Tribes competition it was so so hard I bet but I hope they enjoy it as well right exactly so at this point we will move on to our awarding ceremony first up we have our sponsors Mardi Gras to announce the winner and to do the honor of um, giving the awards is our Vice Mayor, uh, Honorable uh, Jeffrey Ganson, and of course joined by our lovely Congresswoman, Honorable Jam Jam Baronda. Hello! Halabira, Iloilo. Kamusta sa dalo, matugnaw? Subong na matugnaw. Pero samtang nagalawag kita karon sa mga major prizes ng mga awards naton, magainit nga magainit ang inyong pabatsagan. Anyway, my name is Fons Baldonado, the chairman of your Dinagyang Festive Parade, Sponsors Mardi Gras. And sa kada tuig, no, nagalawag kita sang aton nga mga contestants ang aton sponsors Mardi Gras kada tuig kada sabado ang aton nga major prize no before kita maganaw sang aton nga mga grand prize winner mao bisa ko ana isa aton nga mga special awards and of course 
Good evening, Galay Satanan. Of course, sa aton nga mayor, sa aton vice mayor, sa aton congresswoman, sa aton mga councillors, again, sa akong bagid nga pinalangga nga provincial administrator, Dr. Raul Banyas. Kagaradro mong sa crowd, si Attorney Ron, kasi si uh, Mr. Jix, pagitaon nyo da, ara, ginada siya. So first, nalawagon ko, first special award, Best Street Dance Performance goes to Patay Energy Development Corporation. They will receive 5,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Okay, thank you very much. Next special award is Best Festive Music. Best Festive Music will receive 5,000 pesos in cash and trophy. Best Festive Music goes to Jollibee Foods Corporation. Next award is Best Festive Headdress. The winner of the Best Festive Headdress Award will also receive a cash prize of 5000 and a trophy. And the winner, Jollibee Foods Corporation. The next award is Best Festive Marquee. The Best Festive Marquee will receive 5,000 pesos in cash and trophy. Best Festive Marquee goes to Panay Energy Development Corporation. The next award is the best festive mascot. They will receive 5,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Okay, best festive mascot, Jollibee Foods Corporation. This award is Best Festive Costume, and they will receive 5,000 pesos in cash and a trophy.
Best Festive Costume, Jollibee Foods Corporation. The next award is the best in festive choreography. And of course, the winner will receive a cash prize of 5,000 with a trophy. Okay, best choreography. Mami, did I maglakan? Jollibee Foods Corporation. And the champion for the festive parade sponsor Spartagra, Ilo Ilo Dinagyang Festival 2024, will receive a cash prize of 10,000 pesos plus a trophy. Okay, so for the grand winner, very tight a contest. Because tamang kaikip sa mga scores, nag-level up kayo na nga itong talang yung mga contesting groups. The best festive parade grand winner goes to this year, Panay Energy Development Corporation. Congratulations! Thank you so much to this chairman of Sponsors Mardi Gras, Fons Baldonado. And we now have our result for our floats parade. This will be announced by the past president of Rotary Club of Iloilo South, co-chairman floats parade of lights, Mr. Aldin Duyag, to be awarded by past President Jake Keen, Chairman Floats Parade of Lights and incumbent of the Rotary Club of Iloila President Ivy Henson. Together with Congresswoman Jam Jam Baronda and Vice Mayor Ganzon, Jeffrey Ganzon. May we request the results of the Floats Parade of Lights? So this is the third year of the Floats Parade of Lights. And could we request the tabulators for the results as we announce the winners? Our second runner-up for the Floats Parade of Lights Iloilo Dinagyang Festival 2024 will receive 150,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Okay, I guess the results are coming. Could we have now the results of the Floats Parade of Lights? And could we request to announce... The first runner up for the Floats Parade... So we have five competing floats. So we have from Jollibee, we have Sigility, we have IPI, we have Robinsons and Palawan Pawn Shop. Thank you so much for the results. And here we go. All right, the second runner-up for the floats Parade of Lights goes to IPI winning 150,000.
1,000 pesos and a trophy. Could you request a representative from IPI to receive the award? Here we go. Congratulations. A round of applause, please. And now, let's go to the first runner-up. Who will win? How much? It's 200,000 pesos in cash. Thank you so much, Jordan. I'm just making sure so that I will not add up to it if I will say the wrong amount. Okay, the first runner-up goes to... Palawan Pawn Shop! Could we request representatives from Palawan Pawn Shop to please go here to receive your cash prize and your very big trophy? Yes, here are all our Palawan Pawn Shop friends. A round of applause for them, please. They retained their uh, placing. They were also first runner-up last year. champion for this year's Floats Parade of Lights for Iloilo Illumination Iloilo Dinagyang Festival 2024 winning okay I'm gonna read this 300,000 pesos and a trophy the 300,000 is flying <laughs> now the best lighted float is Still, Sagility, the defending champion, is still the champion. A round of applause to Sagility, please. We'd like to request everyone to put a round of applause to all the participating floats because they are our sponsors. They, they are the sponsors of Ilulu Dinagyang Festival 2024. Again, a thank you very much, past president Aldin Duyag of Rotary Club of Iloilo South, who is the co-chairman of this year's Floats Parade of Lights. Also, we would like to thank past president Jake Coquin, chairman of the Floats uh, Parade of Lights, and incumbent president of the Rotary Club of Iloilo, President Ivy Henson. To award, may we request Councillor Cabaluna. Congratulations to our illumination winner. Up next, we have our Kasadyahan sa Kabanwahanan. Illumination. Medyo mapabitin kita, Anay. Hindi lang, Anay, ang kasadyahan. Later lang. Balikan natin, magkanto kita, Anay, sa illumination. Yes! To announce the awards, we have our Artistic Director, Direct Eric Devinagasha. To give the award, he will be all joined by Attorney Sedfri Cabaluna, Iloilo City Councilor. Congratulations in advance to all the winners, to all the participants. You shown bright in the midst of darkness. And Iloilo thanks you for that. Under the grace of Santo Nino, we hope we accept the following results that led us all speechless, or at least pause. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our first 
Technical Award for the Dinag Young Tribes Illumination Competition. Best in Discipline goes to Primo Sitlangan. They will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. This tribe has shown uh, discipline not only in their performance but also throughout the activation starting from the 100-day countdown, the pamokaw, and of course the opening salvo. They led us no? and in fact uh, led the tribes in making them come together. So we would like to thank Tatak Sidlangan, best in discipline. And also, we would like to request Reverend Father Reggie, Reggie Sinorio OSA of San Jose Parish Placer. Best in music and therefore best musical director. Best in music will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Best in music goes to Tribo Manturiao. Join the award of a winner. May we request Councillor Elia Sante and Councillor Doc Nick Baronda to award Tribo Madurial. Our next award is Best in Light Design and therefore also Best. Light designer. Our winner will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Our best in light design goes to Tribo Sitlangan. Our best in music show dynamism and wonderful dynamics appropriate to the dance. Our awardee for Best in Light Design utilize light, illuminating their costumes, telling the story through lights. So these awards are given to these tribes for the Nagyang Illumination. Best in Costume Design and Headdress. Also best costume designer. Best in costume design and headdress will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. And our partner Bingo Plus will also give an additional 20,000 in cash to the winner of the best in costume technical award for Illumination 2024. We also would like to request Juno Sarmiento, Bingo Plus representative to join in the awarding. Best in costume design and headdress, as well as costume designer. We should have actually stayed on stage. Tribo Sitlaran. Dagdagan ang dinagyang fun and happiness kasama ang Bingo Plus. Bingo Plus is a comprehensive entertainment and gaming amusement serves as the first live streaming bingo in the Philippines. Make sure to visit the Bingo Plus booth to win exciting prizes. Kaya kita kids tayo sa Bingo Plus booth located at Valeria Street, Iloilo City. At abangan ang Bingo Plus variety shows simula January 26 hanggang January 28. Kaya nung pang hinihintay nyo mga Ilonggo, visit www.bingoplus.com and download the Bingo Plus app now sa App Store and Google Play. Salamat Bingo Plus sa Bingo Plus, Bingo sa Saya Plus sa Panalo. Best in costume of course showed us how to integrate light in costume, how to tell the narrative through costume, and of course its performance when worn along the streets and in the major judging areas. Best in costume. And now, best in choreography and choreographer. The best in choreography 
awardee will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Ladies and gentlemen, moving through the streets of Iloilo with one full movement is best in choreography. Tribo Sagata! and recognize this tribe who had beautiful costumes and while they are large and while they are of course uh, daunting to carry they were well executed in dance they were uh, beautiful in the area performance as well as when dance across the street they were slowly progressing allowing us to see the beauty of the dance so we thank and congratulate Tribo Sagasa. Lastly, best in performance for the technical awards. Best in performance goes to Tribo Sitlanan. Performance will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. This tribe had a beautiful expression. They have a very strong, even simple yet simple concept. And we see through their story, through the dance, but particularly also through the lines. Best in performance. Like many of our competitions this year, competition was tight. And like we just said, it's anybody's game. Those are just technical awards. It may or may not have a bearing with who wins the top prizes for illumination. Second runner-up. Second runner up for the Ilo Ilo Dinagyang Illumination 2024 will receive 150,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Second runner up goes to Tribo Manduriao. Mandurya's performance was well lit. It really embodied hope in the midst of darkness in Santo Nino as a source of light. Tribo Mandoriao. First runner-up will receive 300,000 pesos in cash and trophy. This does not mean if you have the most number of awards, you will get it. Because sometimes the numbers are very slim. But here we go. Second or first runner-up. Dinagyang Illumination now. On its second year, second runner-up goes to Tribo Sagasa. Beautiful discipline, acting, performing, dancing as one. Wonderful stamina and expression, lighting up, of course, the field. Beautiful production design that is new to many of us, well executed. That is your first 
runner up, Debo Sagasa. Ladies and gentlemen, your champion for the Nagyang Illumination 2024. The champion for Illumination 2024 Street Dance Competition will receive a cash prize of 500,000 pesos with a trophy. Light up in the uniform. Your champion, Timo Sitlaman. Beautiful choreography. We appreciate the dancing, working with the costumes. We appreciated the lighting that is nuanced, controlled, and yet very effective. Gradually lighting up throughout the story of your illumination performance. And we would like to thank once again our board of judges who are here and stand by their decision. Ladies and gentlemen, your champion, Tribo Sid Lavan. Congratulations to all our winners. Now, we move on to the announcement of winners for the Kasadyaan sa Kabanwahanan. <laughs> to announce the winners, we have Provincial, uh, we have Provincial Tourism Officer Gilbert Bombet Marine. And to award, Provincial Administrator, Dr. Raul Banyas. Joining them is IFFI President, Alan Ryan Tan. And Mr. Fons Baldonado. I know everyone is excited. Good luck to everybody. May the best tribe wins. Thank you, judges. Kabanwahanan Technical and Special Awards. So these are the official results. I will start with the best in discipline. Best in discipline will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. Our best in discipline goes to Tugan Festival of Paasin.
Congratulations, Tribo Tultugan. We go to the next award, our best in street dancing. Best in Street Dance awardee will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Our winner for the best in street dancing goes to... Halaud Rinukyao Sokindanonal Festival of Kalino. Congratulations, Kalino. Our next award is for the best in production design. Best in production design will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Our best in production design goes to Festival of Kalino. Congratulations, Kalinog. Our next award is the Best in Music. Best in Music will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Our Best in Music goes to Maasin Tultugan Festival. Our next award is Best in Costume Design and Headdress. Best in Costume Design and Headdress will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Our winner for Best in Costume Design and Headdress goes to... Halaud Rinukyao Sumindanonal Festival of Kalino. Congratulations, Kalino.
Our next award goes to the best in choreography. The winner of best in choreography will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Our best in choreography goes to Maasim Kultugan Festival. For our last technical and special awards, we have the best in performance. Best in performance awardee will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Our winner for the best in performance goes to Maasin Kultugan Festival. We will now proceed with the major awards. We go with Nakasadyaan sa kabanuhanan, second runner-up. The second runner-up will receive 200,000 pesos and a trophy. And also, they will receive 5,000 worth of gift checks from Mang Inasal. We would like to request Jongs Hongko and Ms. Sharon Pasensia of Mang Inasal, Trade Marketing Director and Operations Director, respectively, to join in the awarding. And this year's second runner-up goes to... Leon Kaing Festival! Again, our second runner-up sa Kasadyahan sa Kabanwahanan 2024 will receive a cash prize of 200,000 pesos with a special trophy and also a special gift of 5,000 worth of gift checks from Mang Inasal.
Congratulations to the municipality of Leon. We now award our first runner-up. The first runner-up for Casa Jahan sa Kabanwahanan 2024 will receive 300,000 pesos in cash and trophy. They will also receive 10,000 pesos worth of gift certificates from Mang Inasal. And this year's Kasachan sa Kabanwahanan first runner-up goes to Hanao Dininugyao sa Ginananay Festival of the Municipality of Kalinong. Congratulations, Municipality of Kalino. For our uh, Grand Champion may request, Dr. Raul Banyas, our Provincial Administrator, to announce our Grand Champion. Our Grand Champion for Kasadyahan sa Kabanwahana 2024 will receive 500,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. And also, 15,000 pesos worth of Mang Inasal gift certificates. On behalf of Governor Toto Defensor, the champion in Kesadyahan sa Kabanwahanan goes to Maasin Tultugan Festival. Congratulations to the Tugan Festival of the Municipality of Maasin.
sa tunahaw na ang istorya ng panahon na kilala ka sa ngalan na irong-irong Kunita ko pa iburong To award the people's choice, may we request Sir Alan Tan, the president of IFFI, together with Vice Mayor Jeffrey Ganzon. We would like to thank again our judges, our chief judge for the Nagyang Illumination, Sir Chris Miliado, our chief judge for Kasajahan sa Kabanwahanan, Ms. Shirley Halini Cruz, our Chief Judge for the Nagyang, Mr. Ness Sardin. And now, these are your awards, the people of Iloilo. To join the award, may we request our Congresswoman, Julian Jamjam Baronda. Sir Eric Rudo, Chair for Sadsad Sakalya Real. And now, we proceed to the People's Choice Awards. People's Choice Awards, Illumination Tribes, based on the number of heart reactions garnered in the Iloilo Dinagang Festival FB pages as of 12 noon today, January 28, 2024. The People's Choice Award for Illumination Tribes, Tribo Kahirop of Pavia with 4,300 heart reactions. And the winner for the People's Choice Award for Sad Sad Sakalya Real. Illumination People's Choice Tribo Kahirop of Pavia. Sad Sad Sakalirial People's Choice. Tribo Mulave. With 2,200 heart reactions. The People's Choice Award. For Kasadyahan sa Kabanwahanan, the highest heart reactions. Kasadyahan sa Kabanwahan People's Choice, Katagman Festival, Municipality of Oton, with 12,200 heart reactions. We thank the social media team. For counting the awards. And last, the People's Choice Award. Again, the People's Choice Award has no bearing in the technical, 
or the major awards. The Nagyang Tribes Competition, your People's Choice Award with 10,700 reactions. Tribo Silak of Iloilo City National High School. Congratulations to all the winners of the People's Choice Award. All our winners will receive a cash prize of 10,000 pesos and a trophy. And to add uh, for the winnings of uh, our grand champion, for Kasadyahan Sagabanuahanan, which is the municipality of Baasin's Tutugan Festival, they will be receiving 10 million pesos worth of project from Uswag Ilongo. We thank Congressman Jojo Ang for the prize for the Tutugan Festival winners. I would like to acknowledge uh, my partner in bringing the art to this arts festival, Direct Albert Banyares. I speak in his behalf. He also the cha chairs um, our accommodation of our wonderful judges in everything from the choice of the judges to everything in between up until the results. And of course, Dean Pauline Alfuente, Head of our tabulation committee and Price Water, our uh, company, firm Price Water firm for our tabulation, our official tabulators. We're now ready to award Sad Sad Sakalyal and this goes to the wonderful tribes of the barangay that uh, perform in the streets of Iliilo, starting here at uh, Freedom Grandstand. Yeah. Our special awards. There are only two special awards. Best in Costume goes to the Best in Costume Award. You will be receiving 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Best in Costume, Ribo Pari Anon. Our tribes performed here at Freedom Grandstand and engaged the people of Iloilo City as they party in the streets, going back to the to where Dinagyang started very making in Calle Real in honor of Senor Santo Nino. Ribo Pariano. Best in music. Best in music goes to Ribo Molave. Best in music, a wordy will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. The major awards, second, first runner-up, and the much-coveted darling of the crowd. Sad Sad Sakalyarial, second runner-up, Tribo. This uh, will now receive uh, Ladies and gentlemen, second runner up, Tribo Bagdad! So we are just going to acknowledge them, but we're only having one award. But we will just. Okay? Diretso na ta! Sa darling! Of the crowd, the best 
Sansa tribe that engaged, that engaged the city of Iloilo, that made you dancing in the streets. Nagasansan sa kihapon, ang darling of the crowd. The darling, darling of the crowd, Sansa sa kaliriyal, Iloilo Tignagyang Festival 2024 winner, will receive 100,000 pesos cash plus a trophy. Sad, sad, sa kalya real, darling of the crowd, Vivo, Molave! Again, congratulations to the tribes nga nagpa indis indis sa aton sunset sa Calle Real. We hope to see you again next year. And before we proceed with the awarding sa aton nga dinagyang tribes competition, sa tanan nga mga ilonggo kag mga naga palangga sa mga ilonggo. Please direct your sights to Atonya screen as we will enjoy a highlights of the day video of today's the Dinagyang Tribes competition as uh, prepared by 033 Prod. <laughs>
and gentlemen, the highlights of our competitions for Ilo, Ilo de Nagyang Festival 2024, presented to us by 033 Production. Let's welcome back Sir Eric Divina Grasa for the re announcement of results for our Dinagyang Tribes competition. In Joe. behalf of IFFI Chair Sir Judge Peña, IFFI President Sir Alan Pan, Executive Director Ms. Joyce Clavicilia, Co-Artistic Director Elbert Banyares, and the rest of the team that brought to you Dinagyang 2024. These are the results of the Board of Judges. I first start with a technical award. Ladies and gentlemen, to help us award our winners for the Dinagyang Tribes competition, may we request Congresswoman Jam Jam Baronda, Vice Mayor Jeffrey Ganzon, the President of IFFI, Sir Alan Ryan Ta. And our City Councilors, Attorney Sedfrey Cabaluna. Councilor Ellie Estante. Councilor Doc Nick Baronda. And also would like to... Uh... Request Councillor Jelma Implica, our SK Federation Chairperson. Ladies and gentlemen, what we saw this morning was nothing but the best of Iloilo, Dinagyang. The schools are back. Dinagyang is back. It's everybody's game. Looking at the results of our judges, there wasn't a unanimous decision, and everybody had their favorites. Ladies and gentlemen, our special and technical awards, starting with Best in Discipline. Best in Discipline goes to Vivo Ilovanon. Best in Discipline awardee will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. They show discipline in all of our activations. The one in the countdown, Pabokao in opening salvo. When we went to see them, they were all prepared and disciplined that manifested in the day's performance, in the judging areas, and in the streets. Again, the winner of the Best in Discipline Award will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Best in Sad Sad. This is a tribe that wowed the crowd in the streets of Iloilo. The winner, of this award, the winner of this award will also receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Best in Sad Sad will receive 10,000 and a trophy. Tribo! Iloilo! Our next award, Technical Award, Best in Production Design. Best in Production Design will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. Dear Tribes, did I tell you earlier that this was everybody's and anybody's 
Game. Best in Production Design. Primo. Pakita it. Best in music and your best musical director. Best in music or D will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Best in music goes to it's anybody's game. Vivo, but I. in costume design and headdress as well as best costume designer best in costume design and headdress will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and a trophy beautiful colors wonderful textures costumes that wowed us all Best in costume, design, and headdress. Primo! Ilumanon! Best in choreography and best choreographer. Best in choreography will receive 10,000 pesos in cash and trophy. And the winner of best in choreography will also receive from Bingo Plus an additional prize of 20,000 pesos. To be awarded by Juno Sarmiento, Bingo Plus representative. Masterful use of time and space. Beautiful choreography movement that tells the story effectively. Best in choreography. Primo! Silak! One more technical award, best in performance. The winner of the best in performance award will receive 10,000 pesos and a trophy. Expression, narrative, concept, 
structure, all considered in performance, energy, and passion for the dance. Best in performance. Rubo! Now the major awards. Before we proceed, before I proceed with the announcement of the major awards, I would like to inform our public that the awards and the awardees will be given the prizes for this award in consideration with the rules and regulations of the Dinagyang Festival Tribes Competition. With that said, we have considered all rules, including the use and dimension of props and sets. And so, ladies and gentlemen, it still is anybody's and everybody's game because the results after all, and you have seen the technical awards can spread out with all our tribes. This has been in consultation with the technical committee, with our board of judges, and with the parties concerned, making us do our due, due diligence. Ladies and gentlemen, your official results for the Iloilo Dinagyang Festival Dinagyang Tribes Competition. Fourth runner-up. Fourth runner-up. There is no prize. Do we announce? We move to the next. We announce the fourth runner-up. Chairman Ness Hardin says yes to acknowledge your best effort and your wonderful performance. All of you, fourth runner up, Tribo Salognon! The trophies that you see are installation art pieces by distinguished Silongo artist, Boy Mascolino. Third runner-up. As mentioned by the mayor earlier in his speech, all schools joining will receive the support of the city with five million worth of projects. Ladies and gentlemen, your third runner-up. Tribo! Mandurio!
second runner up. The second runner up for the Nagyang Tribes competition will receive 300,000 pesos in cash and a trophy. Also receive 5,000 worth of gift certificates from Mang Inasal. Again, joining our group on stage are Jong Songko and Sharon Pasencia of Mang Inasal. Our second runner up. Table. Ilumelon! Congratulations to all our artists, to all our principals and support staff, the faculty, and of course the warriors who gave it their all. Ilo Ilo City, fellow Ilongos. Your Iloilo Dinagyang Festival, Dinagyang Tribes Competition, first runner-up. The first runner-up for the Dinagyang Tribes Competition will receive 500,000 pesos in cash and trophy. And also 10,000 worth of gift certificates from Mang Inasal. Your first runner-up. Dinagyang Tribes Competition. Tribo! Pakita! Pagitayet sa tanan, pagitayet sa kaliputan, people, pagitayet. Thank you to Sir Gab and Dean. Thank you to everybody who made this possible. From our sweet sweepers, our uniform personnel, every staff working. For Dinagyang, there are no small parts, only champions. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your champion of the Ilo Ilo Dinagyang Festival 2024 Dinagyang Tribes Competition. The winner of the Dinagyan Tribes competition will receive one million pesos in cash and trophy and, and additional thousand worth of gift certs from Manginasa. And additional to the uh, winnings, ten million pesos worth of project from Uswag Ilongo, courtesy of Congressman Jojo Ang, and another fifteen million pesos worth of project. From the Iloilo City Government, Mayor Jerry Trenias. Iloilo City, fellow Ilongos, Dinagyang country, your champion for the Iloilo Dinagyang Festival 2024, Dinagyang Tribes Competition. Your champion, Kubo. Under the grace 
Είστε σαν τον ίδιο Είναι το πλάσμα από το ίδιο Αντί να πιάν Φεστιβάλ Thank you, Department of Education, our strong partner for the Nagia Festival. Congratulations at Ananya Magdalahor sa mga competitions ang dinagyan 2024! We have a new champion! Tribo Panay! Grabe! Spread out ang ato nga mga technical awards. Very, I don't know, it's anybody's ball. Can you get it on Bally Sir Eric? Yes! Hindi ko hindi ka mapaktaan kung sino o mada ko. Kaya no, halos na nan. We have been talking about it. Na nan kit siya. Deserving of all their prizes. Congratulations, Kate, sa bilog ng mga organizing committee sa nga itong Ilo-Ilo Dinagiang Festival 2024. Congratulations, Ilo City Government, sa IFFI. Thank you so much also to the Ilo Provincial Government and sa Nose Parish Placer. We are your hosts para sa awarding ceremony. My name is Jordan Toledo. I'm Carmel Romero. And thank you so much to all our spectators, from our guests from different parts of the world and all over the Philippines. Thank you for supporting us, most especially our judges. Thank you, dear thank judges. You, judges. Congratulations. Thank you very much to all for the 2024. Ilo, ilo, 